wanna go Today I'm in San Francisco, California, where I'm gonna try to lure someone away from Father's Day weekend to go on the fishing experience of a lifetime in Elfin Cove, Alaska. Mary, sing to me. The question me is, will they have the guts to go? Two phone calls and five minutes will decide. How bad do you want to go fishing? Here's the situation. Today we're at Fisherman's Wharf in San Francisco, California. It's Father's Day weekend, and I'm going to be walking around, and I'm going to try to find a father-son or father-daughter to take to Elfin Cove, Alaska to go for some salmon and halibut. Let's do it. Where's your dad at? My dad? Uh, Phoenix. Uh, he's not here, huh? No. He's in Miami Beach. Hey, come back here. Hey, how's it going today? You guys taking a chat? Just missed a free trip to Alaska. Your dad's not here, so that's unfortunate. Yeah, thanks. Thanks for nothing. <laughs> it's the Traz, Alcatraz. That over there, that's one place you don't want to be. You know, Alaska would be fun, but we're in San Fran, so I can live with it. It's the last frontier. Yep. <laughs> I don't really know what that means. That means that, that means it. there's so much wilderness up there, it would blow your mind. Final answer? Yeah, no. Uh, you're from? Birmingham, Alabama. Hoover, Hoover. Hoover, Alabama. But you like to fish, huh? Oh, she, oh, she loved the fish. She loved the fish. Eva is my fisherman, too. Eva loves the fish. She's my eight-year-old. And you're obviously a diehard fisherman? I love the fish. <laughs> so if I were to tell you that right now, I have a plane ready to take you to Elfin Cove, Alaska to stay at the Cove Lodge, to go catch king salmon and halibut. Do you uh, want to soak your daughter out with a fishing trip of a lifetime and go? I'll give you two phone calls in five minutes to talk to your wife and work it out. Where is it now? Elfin Cove, Alaska. Can Eva go? We can take Eva. Good, Eva, is that, God, is it okay if Eva and I go? And we come back Monday? That'd be awesome, We can make arrangements. Go with it. Yes, yes. You're gonna go to Alaska right now, bro! Yeah! Well, this is gonna be a, a Father's Day that you two will remember forever. In Alaska! <laughs> oh, hey, Father's Day is Sunday! Father's Day is Sunday. Yes. We're gonna go to West Marine and get him all the gear he needs. <laughs> and uh, let's get you and your daughter geared up. You can't go up to Alaska without the proper rain gear. You know a shopping trip does wonders for enthusiasts. <laughs> I think we've got all of our stuff. The raincoats, the boots, the life jackets, shades, socks. I think we're all geared up and ready to go. Thank you. <laughs> it's going to be a good Father's Day. Coming up to Alaska with Randy and Eva was just absolutely a blast. Do not try this at home. We're going to fly into the ocean. Oh my goodness, Eva Grace. He's just so cool, dude. This is cool. Well, I just want you to know. This is something that you see in magazines and that you read about. You don't expect you're going to experience Alaska. The mountains, the vastness, the wildness. It just makes you feel tiny, and uh, it's just a special thing to be able to see. I'm glad Mommy said yes, Daddy. We're all glad Mommy said yes. <laughs> this is going to be his best Father's Day ever because he's always wanted to come to Alaska. Steal away! Yeah, Eva! Coming up. I never caught it. Face that. It's this hard oh, villain. It was like playing Daddy. Steal away! Welcome back. We've taken Randy and his daughter Eva on the fishing trip of a lifetime from San Francisco, California to Elfin Cove, Alaska. They have a dog. We're here. Elfin Cove, baby. Elfin Cove is an amazing place. I thought I was dreaming. I don't think there's any place like it in the world. It's hard to describe how cool it is up here unless you experience it. It's a completely different world. It's like going to Mars. This is as far as you can get in the wilderness and still have things like hot water, hot tub, pool table, satellite TV, cell phones work, uh, etc. This is a nature's wonderland here. 
Right after we landed, uh, Captain Gordy, the owner of Cove Lodge, said, hey man, let's go fishing. To be able to just go five, 10 minutes outside the lodge is really exciting, especially for Randy and Eva. I've never caught anything over that big. Eva and Emily and I have been fishing for the past five to 10 years, and we use a hook on our brim that is the smallest hook that you can buy. And we catch the smallest brim that you can catch on the smallest hook with the smallest worm that we dig up in our own backyard. These are gonna be very aggressive fish. Uh, for the most part, they have real heart mouth parts. For our bottom fishing, for halibut and rockfish, ling cod, we want to have as light a gear as we can possibly have. Basically what you're doing is you're taking bait, secret weapon. You're dropping it down anywhere from 80 to 200 feet. You're dropping it right to the bottom, and you're just jigging it, bouncing it right on the bottom. <laughs> Literally within our first or second drop, we started hanging fish. Yeah, I got one. Yeah! <laughs> oh my goodness. <laughs> Man. Mr. Ling, yeah! <laughs> First drop. And it looked prehistoric. <laughs> Holy cow! Oh my God. Looked like a, a frogfish. <laughs> catching a ling does not relate to catching anything that I've ever caught before. A 25 pound ling cod. I would hate to have a 300 pounder on there. <laughs> Eva! Eva Grace! Go Eva, go! The place is teeming with life. And then we got to face that, this, this yeah. heart villain. Yeah, Keep cool. going Eva, take your time. Eva was just a trooper. Nice work Eva! Thank you! Nice. Not very tall, so it was, it was a little bit difficult for her to, to get the rod up and hold it and reel. It's hard working. Yes. <laughs> She's a professional angler already. Here it is, here it is. Here we go, Graham, we keep going. Whoa! Wow, Eva! <laughs> Eva Grace! She was touching the fish, kissing the fish, Mwah. really nice. just having a hands-on experience with them and uh, taking advantage of every moment. Here he is. I think I have one. Oh! Uh. Hey, Eva! <laughs> but it's hard. The fish in Elfin Cove, they just jump right on the hook themselves. Sometimes you never know what you're going to catch when you go fishing and if you're going to catch anything at all. But in Alaska, it's a little bit different. Yellow-eyed rockfish. That's pretty. That's a halibut. I might keep my status as Mr. Ling. What is that? Tiger on. Green Ling. Another Ling. Arrowtooth flounder. Black bass. Fish on every drop. I think it's a Mr. Ling. You think yeah. you're gonna become Mrs. Ling on this trip? Oh no, if you're Mr. Ling. <laughs> <laughs> yes. It was like playing daddy. Good job, Eva. Hey little baby. Eat it.